This is the kind of devastation you see all over Raqqa at the moment. Buildings which have been absolutely leveled by airstrikes. Airstrikes have been pounding this city for months and months now, both from the Russians, but now mainly from the coalition forces. We've heard them coming in all morning. You can also see what this city used to look like under the rule of the so-called Islamic State. These shop fronts have a mark painted on the front to show that they were paying taxes for protection. That's also what these sandbags have done. There is evidence of the fighting everywhere. This upturned car peppered with bullet marks. We've seen ISIL forces using a lot of V-beds, vehicle-borne explosive devices, truck bombs, as they did in Mosul. But the SDF forces, the Syrian Defense Forces, say that they haven't seen so many in the last couple of months because they think that the ISIL forces remaining inside the city have virtually run out. The front line is down here about two kilometers. And you can also see the level of destruction that the fighting has left behind. And what is very striking here is that there are no civilians at all. We think there are still about a thousand people trapped inside ISIL territory, but we can't be sure. And in the areas which the SDF have fought through, there is nobody. Tony Cheng, CGTN.